This video is about the barangay bake shop here, that little, neat, tidy, very nice bread bake shop here in Barangay Esperanza. So, I'm here now in Barangay Esperanza, being stranded in Camotes Island for a few days, I think. We're here yesterday and we're here again today. And we are just stopping here in the dainty, clean, and nice bakery that we found here in Barangay Esperanza that serves as the Barangay Bake Shop. So, what you're looking at here are the different bread Filipino style. So, I will be explaining to you how what's the name and how much it is that we're charging here for that kind of bread so let's start with the cookies this is the yellow cookies maybe squash cookies for two pesos each then you got a chocolate crinkle cookies at two pesos each you got the hopia hopia that's favorite among Filipinos as well at 2 pesos each. And you got the green lips. The green lips, again, is 2 pesos each. And then another type of hopia, the mongo hopia, at 2 pesos each. Now you got all the substantial bread on down here. That one there is called the king roll. That's one I have. And then the star bread. That's only 5 pesos each. You got the next one. I just that's the papaya bread at five pesos each next you can see I have to bend down to make it more shadow so the it's against the light and that's the rainbow bread at five pesos each you got the squash bread five pesos each and you got the german bread german bread whoa i have to bend down more to make it german bread um five pesos each and this one is the called the empanada bread five pesos each and this is the spanish bread one with caramel inside that's five pesos each and this one it's a slice of pie. I have to bend down. There, you can see it better if I had a sh my shadow on it. And that's what we called here in the Philippines as pig pie. That's five pesos per slice. This one is the choco marble. Five pesos per slice. Then that's the choco flour with chocolate. Five pesos, and this is my favorite here on the bottom. That's called the star bread, five pesos each, and that's the corn bread. Just shape like corn, but it's still flour, you know. Five pesos each, and that one is another type of corn bread, five pesos each, and that one that's quite historic actually. This one, this is called Ilorde. It's named after the famous boxer in the Philippines, Plash Elorde. Because you can see, it's like a punch bag. Punch bag shape. And you buy it anywhere in the Philippines. They always have this kind of... In um, local bakeries, I suppose. But not the international bakeries. But when you go to a local bakery, they always have this Elorde. Because it's named after the Plash Elorde. A very famous boxer. Filipino boxer. And... That bread is named after him to honor him. And some of the... Here, the patata. Like a snacks, cracklings. Made of thin flour. And they also have... That's only 6 pesos per pack. And they got some stick bread. 10 pesos per pack. And then they have the sliced bread. The pilang sliced bread, madam. 20 pesos for the sliced bread. So, you can see, this bake shop is really serving the constituents here in the barangay. And they have a very nice bread because we were just planning to buy drinks and then taste one or two of the bake shop. But we end up buying more because they really bake it so nice. 
Thank you, Ate. Thank you. So, thank you. So, this is the bake shop. Wala ging nga ni mong bake shop, ti. So, that's what. Are they, anyway, they're known. That's, that's the only bake shop here, no? Layo. Sa layo sa tete. Ah, so this is like the one here in Barangay Esperanza. Lasa din na.